It's time for League of Legends. The time for League of Legends. Yes, guys, it's League of Legends time with Santa, Shadows, and Brace. You guys have been requesting this. Let's do it. There's so much to catch up on on Laura Behind the Game. Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Lore Behind the Game, a place where we justify video game lore. What does that even mean? What does that, what the hell does that even mean? But yeah, it's a place where we go and discuss your favorite video game lore, such as Overwatch, Destiny, Halo games. There's a lot coming up with you guys. So if you want to be able to like let us know, be sure to let us know on Patreon. Yeah, and also you'll be able to let us like know on our Discord because yeah, our Discord is Patreon exclusive and also for Twitch subs. Yeah, so if you want to let us know, there will be a poll and we have a lot coming up because there's so much lore when it comes to these games. It's not even funny. But anyway guys, Set of Shadows Embrace. I have not even been able to see this in the long time that it has been released. Let's let's go on YouTube. Let's see how long how long has this been out? Okay, it's been it's been like a month. I'm not that behind. I'm just like it's just shut up. As you see, it literally says October 15th. And yeah, I'm not that far behind, okay? So in the description it says, those trapped, okay, in darkness need light the most. That is fact. Music by Riot Music Team. Additional production by The Crystal Method. Oh, animation by Did Digic Pictures. Very nice. See, they're making, again, they finally are getting their own animu and their own anime. So let's go back to some of my videos when Kat was saying, League of Legends, make an anime. How long have I been waiting for this? Well, you guys are probably waiting it much longer because, again, I'm new to this fandom, so <laughs> probably much longer than me. But anyway, guys, yeah, today is Santa, Santa's Shadows Embrace. Again, I'm probably butchering her name. And for some reason, based on the description alone, sounds like it can pretty be dark. I feel like we're gonna go, go that, down that dark route, you know? But anyway, guys, let's get started. Fandom Positivity Keyboard, bless us with your mu- Wait, this isn't Weeb Watchathon. But hey, if you guys are also interested in anime reactions, be sure to check out Weeb Watchathon on allagesgeek.com. Yeah, short ad, short and sweet, just like me. Let's get started. Oh, he is screaming. Oh! Oh! Yo! This enemy still looks- wait, 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 this doesn't look like- like, this is so real. This is legit so real. Oh my boy! Oh my god, oh, oh! This is so freaking hype! Dude! Dude! Thresh is just like, get the fuck out of here! Get the fuck out of here! Oh! Oh! You get off of him. You get off of him. Oh, he's, he's sword broke. <gasps> oh, that is creepy. Oh, he's like, I'm gonna kill you now, boy. You're dead to me. Ooh. Ooh, hit him where it hurts, boy. Hit him where it hurts. Holy crap. Ooh, ooh, he's trapped now. He is trapped. Wait, is his arm? Oh, oh, I thought his arm was cut off. I was about to have a heart attack right now. What am I doing with my hand? Oh my god. Are you okay? Ooh. Ooh, ooh. Oh. Stop, you're getting distracted. Oh my god. No, 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 no! Oh, she's so pretty. Oh! Yes! So they helped him. Yes! Oh! There's more, there's more. They're hugging, oh hell. 
freaking thrush looks like he's a freaking badass in the boat. Oh my god. Okay, so let's discuss this. First, we're gonna go in again, as we saw, this was blind mode. So I'm gonna guess, let me just look this up to be certain. So League of Legends, because I don't know much about their lore. League of Legends, Senna. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Okay, so Senna. Cursed from childhood and being haunted by the supernatural black mist, Senna joined the sacred order known as the Centiles of Light and fiercely fought back, only to be killed. Her soul imprisoned in the land of the cruel wraith. Oh my god, it's Thresh. So Thresh kind of, as we saw, kind of captured Senna in the lantern. Her soul, like God, just, just great. Fought back only to be killed, her soul to be imprisoned by the lantern of the cruel wraith Thresh. But refusing to lose hope within the lantern, Senna learned to use the use of mist, which reemerged a new life forever changed. Now wielding darkness along with a light, Senna seeks the black mist by turning it against itself with every blast of her relic weapon, redeeming the souls lost within. So that's actually very helpful. So we're gonna be able to do this, as you know, each of the characters will be getting their own lore discussion on League Champ Tales, which is again, all Age of Geeks series where we explore all the, like the, again, all the legends, all the, all the, I can't speak, all the legends of the champions. So if you guys wanna check that out, be sure to let us know who you want us to be able to react to next and discuss next on League Champ Tales. We're po possibly going in order, but again, I would love to know what you guys wanna see next. So that was Senna who came out of the, out of the, um, the lantern. So let's see what the comments are actually saying here, because again, I love being able to see others, others' comments too. Thresh, nerfed. He no longer has 100% wife steal. <laughs> so there are dozens of unannounced champions in Thresh's Lantern. Fact. I want a New Jersey champion. Riot. How big do you want your gun to be? Senna. Yes. That scene when Lucian rushed to hold Senna so she doesn't get dragged back into the lantern has to be one of the most touching scenes ever. Fact. Seems like this is the first moment in LOL history when the characters really did what they intended to do when they joined the league. Congrats, Lucian. You did it. My boy Lucian! Let's give a freaking round of applause. Let's do this! League of Legends logic. If she wears a hoodie, she's in a relationship. Oh, you know why? You know why? Because my freaking Zion from Rakan. Oh my god. I don't even play anymore, but I got goosebumps when she protected him. Facts. Preach it. Freaking preach it. Imagine playing as Thresh, and during a fight, one of your stacks pops out of your lantern and starts shooting you. Just imagine that. Imagine if you captured something while playing Thresh, and then you get shot by it. League of Legends logic, yes! Notice how a single time Lucian aimed for Thresh, but for his lantern, he was so desperate to save his wife. Gotta love that. Gotta love that Husbandu and Waifu right there. Make it happen. I wanna see more with them. This man slayed, stayed loyal for six years. Relationship goals, edit. The look when Lucia noticed it was her was the purest relief animated face ever. This man truly loves her. Fact. LOL. League of Legends. Community. So Lucian broke one gun? Rework? Riot. He found a new one on Amazon. So don't worry about it. Gotta love Amazon. Shout out to community member and moderator, Knight, who actually worked at Amazon. Knight, we want to hear more of your Amazon stories. She protect. He attack, but most importantly, they found each other back. Oh, I love that one. <laughs> oh, I love that one. All right, so let's go scene by scene now. So as we've seen, this is his fucking wife, all right? Lucian's all like, I'm gonna destroy, I'm gonna kill, and Thresh is all like, I'm gonna come at you, and you ain't got nothing on me, son. You ain't got nothing on me because I got your freaking wife trapped in my freaking lantern. Freaking goals. I mean, if anything, Thresh is like, he's a freaking thrasher. All right, so then they're fighting, they're fighting, they're fighting. It's epic, it's amazing. And then it broke. So he's like all like, shoot, what am I gonna do? And this moment when Thresh is kind of like holding him into his face, it's so powerful because literally, he's literally like looking into him into his soul. So let's play this scene, shall we? 
And it's like he's about to kill him. He's about to suck out his soul and say, like, you're part of my collection now. Let's put you in my little land set for safekeeping. Maybe Thrush just wants friends. Maybe that's all it's about. And then Lucian's all like, hell no. Freaking hell no. That is rage, okay? When your adrenaline is up to here, that is freaking rage. He wants to save his waifu. So then, boom, shika shika. Boom, he out. And then suddenly, suddenly, this is so powerful. Now that I know the lore behind this. He's ready to kill. He's ready to destroy. But then he puts it. Look at that. Look at that face. Look at that face. Just freaking look at his freaking face. That is a face of relief. Now, he must love her so much because as we see, you don't see much of her right now. All right. You see her coming out of the lantern. But he's all like, oh, my God, it's her. So he must love her that much. So powerful. And she's about to kill. She's like, okay, honey, look, look at that face. He's like, oh my God, my waifu, she is out. I am so happy. But she's like, honey, now is not the time. I have to go and kill this man. So just look at his freaking face. I freaking love this. Oh my God, it's freaking OTP moment. He's like, honey, oh my God. And she's like ready to just destroy. Like freaking look how big that is. Shaboopy. At first I thought that no, at first I thought she was attacking him, but no, she's protecting him because she loves him. And this is such a powerful reuniting scene because she knew at that moment when he saved her, okay, when he got her out of that and then she protected him, she knew he was gonna be like, oh my God, my baby's back. And she's like, no, I have to protect you because I have distracted him. And then Thresh is like, shoot, I can't beat the power of love. The gun is freaking huge. Like, look at her. She is a badass and I love her. I freaking love you. Oh, stop it. That hug. I freaking love her. I stand. I stand. I stand this relationship. I stand them. Another OTP cat is found. Look. Oh. And like, in this moment, it's like now we can relax. Now we can hug each other. But then she opens her eyes and she's ready. But then Thresh. Thresh is like, bitches, I'm back. Ain't nobody better than me. So then he leaves to get his next victim. So this is all like so freaking powerful. Like, like out of all of the series and the, the cinematics and everything when it comes to League of Legends, when they have the power of love or something like that, like with Zaya, Rakan, and how they are. You can't say it Rakan. It has to be Rakan. As, as you know, I, I mean uh, Zaya. So it's like when you see that power, it's like so wholesome because they know what they're doing. They literally know what they are doing. They want us to feel for these characters and have our hearts cut out. But that's Rito for you. That's what they do best. But yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this episode and you want more like it, if you want the unedited episode, be sure to check it out on our Patreon page. Because in 2020, not even just for League of Legends, but if you guys like anime reactions or anything for our We Watchathon series, you guys will be getting 12 episodes per week while everybody else on the channel gets more edited content and maybe one to two per week. And also, if you really like what All Age of Geek does, be sure to check out our social media pages because it's fun and it's awesome. And yeah. But anyway, my friends, I hope you have an amazing day. You stay weird, you stay wonderful, you stay awesome. Until the next video, embrace your fangirl and your fanboy every single day. Bye, guys. Stand up and stand that fandom.